Well hello there! Today's video is actually going to be a quick but extremely important one because today we can actually pre-download weathering waves and the reason that I say it's extremely important is because on the official release date there's gonna be a lot of people trying to download the game and logging in so there is actually a possibility that even the official site's going to crash. So I really think that everyone should just pre-download the game now. Because who knows what might actually happen. It's always better to be safe than sorry. So in today's video I'm just gonna tell you how you can actually pre-download the game. All you gotta do is just go to your browser and just search weathering waves now you just have to go to the official website and you're gonna see some links here for ios it's apple store android google play but today i'm gonna just show you the windows version just click on the link and you just have to choose whichever path you want your game to be downloaded on so just select the folder that you want the game to be downloaded on and just click download and now I'm using the free download manager but it's really not that different even if you downloaded it from the browser that you're using. I'm just gonna let this download as you can see my internet speed is not that great so by the power of editing wow it's complete how did I do that? Now just select the file and just open the setup. As you can see, there's this window. You just have to click the I have read and agree to the terms of service and privacy policy. And just click install. Now if you have never played any type of these games, you might think, wow, the installation was so fast. Oh, ah, that's how they get you. You click start and now the real download begins. <laughs> I highly recommend you check how much data you actually have on your internet because the game is not, you know, that small. I mean, yes, compared to some of the games that we see nowadays, it might not seem like a lot, but still, better to be safe than sorry. Also, don't forget to check how much disk space you actually have. You might want to have a little bit more disk space because you don't know how big the future updates are going to be. So again, better to be safe than sorry. You can just select the path that you want to download the game on, like in whichever drive or folder. As you can see, mine is already selected, so I just hit download. And with the speed that I have, dear lord. Just a second, let me see if I can actually fix this thing. Ta-da! What the power of editing! <laughs> I fixed my Wi-Fi speed. I mean, I know it's still not that good, but uh, I think it's better than 100 hours. But again, voila! With the power of editing, the game is fully downloaded. Now, if you actually hit start, you're gonna see... Uh, this terms of service again and just listen i know you don't read the terms of service all right so don't judge me okay if there's actually a do you want to allow public and private network to access this app just click allow now if you have played any other gacha games you know that there's actually another file to be downloaded and it's not that much it's like 500 mix so again, with the power of editing, well, the power of editing didn't work. There's actually another download that's around like 300 mix. So, let's do that again. With the power of editing, the download is complete. You just have to restart the game. Just click start and now you just have to log in. If you have pre-registered, you will actually get some extra stuff as well, but 
Just keep in mind that you have to be over 16 <laughs> to play the game. I don't have any comments about this one. So after logging in, keep in mind you can actually do it from the web as well. And then you will be greeted with this message that it's basically the release date. And as the recording of this video, it's basically just in two days, so just have a teeny tiny bit more patience. I know it's hard. Two more days. Two more days. With that being said, I hope this video was helpful to you in some way or another. I hope your pre-download has gone smoothly. If you have any other question about the game in general, anything, you know, just ask me in the comments. Anyway, as always, I'm Spike and that's all I have for this one. See you in the next one. Bye!